everyone, welcome to jobskillshare.org. In this video, we are going to actually set up a brand new uh, laptop, uh, and this video could be useful for a home user. Uh, basically, you want to know how to set up a brand new laptop, and this video could be useful for anyone that is working in an IT department and they want to know how to take care of their laptop at home, uh, or even if someone uh, in uh, business. So this is a laptop model, Aspire E15 Acer, uh, brand new laptop. If you open it, they, they come up with this little support uh, page. You can call them if you have any issues uh, or setting up issues. But we're going to do things in an IT way, so then you won't need support for a long time. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up and plug it in. And first time when we turn it on, we'll talk about it, what we have in this laptop. And this is a pretty good looking laptop as you guys can see. Um, and I'm gonna open it up right now. There you go, brand new, whoo, okay. And it even says right there that's 12 hours battery, you know? Well, let's see. And it's a full HD uh, Acer. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, turn it on right now. Really nice uh, Intel i5 inside. And the card, graphic cards, and some other things and what does it have basically this is the model right here this is uh, i5 and 8 GB RAM and 256 uh, SSD and it should be a good fast computer for good uh, processing it was about $500 on Amazon so let's go ahead and get it get it started of course you need a charger it comes with it so you need to make sure you plug this in this way and then you can uh, put the other end into the laptop right here and then make sure uh, you turn it on safely. So once the power is in, everything is plugged in, this is the power button right here. There you go. You can hear the sound. Just came up, answer. So now let's see how things will roll from now. It's just the first time this is getting started right now. And as soon as it starts, this is a Windows 10 uh, front, like you know, the first page for Windows 10 when you install a brand new Windows 10 machine this is what you get so depending on where you live what's your uh, timing time zone so I live in Eastern time so I'm gonna go ahead and change that from here and uh, this is pretty big so you probably will get confused so make sure left and right you don't see but it's right here really nice uh, pad right here so I'm gonna go ahead and change this to Eastern There you go. Oop. And forgive me if I am, because this is my first time even touching this laptop, so I might be clicking on things. Um, so you're going to go ahead and accept this. And then it will ask you for what uh, Wi Fi, if you have Wi Fi, make sure you connect to that. So then you will get to this screen. This is where Microsoft have default settings for you, so you don't have to mess around with settings. If you don't know this, about settings and everything what it is you can customize everything like you know you can say do you want to send errors to Microsoft now sometimes it's good because then that's how they get things better and then some other information so I usually keep it use express setting it will save you time and now it's restarting okay so you have two options in here one is to use your Microsoft account. This is your live uh, Outlook account, Microsoft account. This uh, you need to have. Uh, it's like a basically, if you had an email address with Microsoft, you can use this right here on the password. Uh, if you don't have an account, you can create one. But if you don't want that, you don't want to that. You want you don't want to do this online account. The the benefit of this is you can click on Learn More, and you will find out many other things. Like it will automatically connect to your email, uh, OneDrive, and everything. So a lot of things will work. Even some apps will work. Uh, but I usually do is I create um, a, a local account, so then I can do this later on also. So we'll do skip this step. We're going to do this. Okay, and now what basically is asking me create an account for this PC. This is a local account, so I'm gonna go ahead and create an account right now. This is my brother name, and I'm gonna go ahead and give it a password. Okay, 
So now we have given, uh, we have created an account. This is an administrator account on this machine. So let's, there you go. It will log into that account automatically after once you give it the password. So in this uh, section, we have a very big updates waiting. There's depending on you know how many updates you will have after you purchase a laptop. I'm going to uncheck this right now because we are going to do this in a second part where we set up a laptop right now. This is a brand new laptop. Everything is set up. In second part, what we're going to do is we're going to trim down some of the things that maybe in this machine came from a company and we need to remove that. And we also need to update the system. How do we do this quickly? What kind of application should we put? That's a normal application like web browsers and some other things, uh, some well-known applications, just few of them. And then in part two, the ending of part two, actually we will do make part three. Part three, we are going to make a full backup of this laptop. In case something happens, you will have it for many, many years. You will have no issues with this laptop. So I'll see you guys in part two because this laptop right now is ready to be used. So part two, uh, I'm going to go ahead and sh show you guys how to update it, how to put applications on it. Uh, and then part three, we are going to do up a uh, full backup of this laptop. And then even in a case of recovery, I'll show you what to do. Thank you.